The bye week is officially bye-bye for Notre Dame. It's now <laughs> Pittsburgh week for the Irish as they get ready to host the Panthers. Yeah, Marcus Freeman with his comments and our look at sports. Hey, Julianne. Hey there, guys. Has anyone ever said uh, fighting Irish? Is that, is that a thing? But uh, <laughs> we're looking ahead to the Panthers now. No more fighting Irish. But uh, Marcus Freeman started out his press conference looking back at that impressive win over USC last week. Now, Freeman named Audric Estime and Xavier Watts the offensive and defensive players of that game, respectively. And he talked about the difference between that big win and the loss the week before in Louisville and well it all comes down to that one word again execution and not the play calling so when his players took the heat that week before against the Cardinals they're getting the praise for that win over the Trojans yeah I think the the biggest thing for for the USC game was they played fast because they were clear on what exactly their expectation was. They were relentless, um, you know, and, and you, you got to give credit to Al Gold and our defensive staff for getting our guys prepared. Um, but, but at the end of the day, you put so much, you can put so much emphasis into a game plan, but if the kids don't execute what you want them to, to do, then it's the game plan's fault. No, it's, it's the ability to get your kids to understand what you want and let them play fast. That is the most, the most important thing as a coaching staff we have to do. And, and that's the biggest misconception about coaching football is that it's scheme. No, it's, it's clarity. You have to get your guys to understand exactly what you want so they can play fast and execute. And um, that's a great example for what our defense has been able to do.